So I'm walking around the malls this morning and it is like a ghost town in there. Just a ghost town, which is good, which is good. I'm glad to see people with, with, with what's going on right now, staying home, doing the social distancing. I think that's all really important. But I do find it still, we're, we're we in this kind of panic mode. We're seeing people just buying what seems like the silliest things. Toilet paper for one, we all know about toilet paper. I get it, toilet paper. We all know canned foods, I get it. Hey, we're, we're, we went out the other night too, and we had kind of laughed at it, you know, being like, oh, everybody's doing this, but you know, silly, all silly. But now you're just like, well, now what happens when I just actually just need food? Of course, we went out the other night and you can see our cupboards. We've got like canned goods and we've got the fridge filled up and the freezer filled up and we should be good for a while. And hopefully we we got enough toilet paper, I guess, going around. You know, for, for all of us, social distancing, keep it, keep it there. Try not to gather in your big groups. And try to stay well try to stay safe be smart I love what a lot of people are saying you know it's not necessarily about you as maybe a younger person or a healthy person not really getting overly affected by it but it's the fact that we become carriers and can really affect somebody else that may get really sick or even it may be fatal for so really really important for that now in regards to that I'm gonna be doing videos for the next couple weeks my, my work where I work full time has shut down till pretty much the end of March for sure because of what's going on, which is great. And uh, this gives me a lot of time. So I'll probably be doing a whole bunch of new videos. I think on, especially a lot of the cameras and lenses that I have, there's a bunch of videos that I wanted to do. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to hop on those and I'll have some time, which is, which is great. Today though, today though, I've had this camera right here. This is the V-Mate, the Snopa V-Mate. I got this on a Kickstarter or an Indiegogo campaign about a month, month and a half ago it arrived. It had a bunch of issues. I did a little video on it, kind of a first look and a software overview, etc. Did a little video of it. It has gone through, I don't know how many firmware updates. They, it seems like there's like two firmware updates a week. It just, I think it's on like 29 now or something like that. Um, I'll, I'll put a list down here of exactly what the firmware number is that this camera has been tested on. So this guy right here, right? So it's it's like the Osmo Pocket, but it's Snopa's version. Cool. So I'm gonna take it out today. Take it out. We're gonna go for a walk, the family and I. And I figured why not take it out and give it some good outdoor testing to see if a bunch of it has fixed. All right, and that's coming up. time served in the war he used to pick up radio waves that he said were from the future as little children we would gather round to us he was a giant but when it came to taking medicine the man was non-compliant he'd tell me hey what would you say if i could build a little vessel that could take us to another time and place Alright, so we're outside just trying out this camera and uh, still getting SD card errors all the time. So you're really just crossing your fingers hoping that it's actually recording anything because you don't know. You just, you just don't know. So I'm at arm's length. It'd be nice when they actually have some kind of like wide angle for it, I think. Hopefully that'll come out at some point because it's hard to keep yourself in the shot. But I think I'm doing an okay job. But we'll get some shots around here. We're just out for a walk. And uh, I think a good test. This is running the most current firmware, so 0.29. They've been coming out with firmwares like crazy, so that's great. But hopefully more to come because he still has got some issues. Still has some issues. All right. Back to, back to walking. If the burning of the engines could be powered by the smile on your face, what will you say? Take us fishing at the local dam We 
would bike down from his house Telling stories of a captain he knew From his travels to the past The cannonballs and muskets and the weapons they used Were anything but modern So grab a rock grenades and proximity mines Together they ran the ocean He'd tell us, wait, what would you say If I could build a little vessel that could take us to another time and place What would you say If the burning of the engines could be powered by the smile on your face And uh, we're going to go back. I'm going to take a look at it just to see how well it looks, how stable it looks. got to get used to moving it around because it's definitely a little different than if you just had like a GoPro or a static camera. So, but yeah, we're going to go back in. I'm going to take a look at the footage, see if it looks better than uh, it did when I first used it like a month ago. Okay, back into the car. All right, guys, so you've seen a bunch of the footage now. You've seen all the footage that I kind of took throughout our walk, which hopefully you, you look at it and you're like, oh, that was good or that was crap or whatever. There are still some issues with the Snopa V-Mate as of shooting this. And this is on firmware version 29, I believe 0.29, something like that. I don't know. Again, I'll put it down below. Running, especially on an iPhone. Now, for a lot of people that are running on Androids, they have even more issues because of the software compatibility. But on the iPhone, the software seems to be running pretty good. The only real issue is going to be, again, could be firmware, but a few things. Number one, the SD card issue. That thing is constantly still, not as bad as it was. I've tried multiple different micro SD cards. I formatted them in the camera. It runs for a while. It says there's an SD card issue. It's Sometimes it's recording, sometimes it's not. Some It's, it's not good. That needs to be fixed right now. You guys need to, Snoopa, if you're listening, Snoopa, however you pronounce your name, the V-Mate needs to get fixed. That is a real for one annoyance. And I actually had it a couple times where it seemed to like lock the whole camera up where it was just nothing. I couldn't even power it off. And about a minute later, it just powered off on its own. But I couldn't start recording. I couldn't stop recording. I got this SD card error and uh, nothing was happening so that's not good color is better all the footage that i shot there that you guys saw way better it used to be really warm so it really had a really yellow tinge to it that's that's softened out a lot so the white balance considerably better i still think it has a bit more to go but i like where it's headed and i think the the auto white balance is doing much better i did have some issues with it shooting on angle now most of the footage you saw here was straight but i'll bring up some footage here that you guys can see before I straighten the footage. And you can see that it's definitely got, it's on an angle and I ran it through a calibration. I made sure the lens piece was 
upright. I don't know what it was doing, but it wouldn't shoot straight. And pretty much every shot, well not every shot, but a lot of shots, I had to adjust by about anywhere from two to four degrees. So that's not something that I, I wanna have to do all the time. Lastly, focus. It's, it's, again, for the most part, it hits focus pretty accurately, but it does have a real tendency in areas and times that it shouldn't, that it just misses focus completely or it doesn't want to readjust focus uh, when you're moving the camera. So that's that's still a concern and hopefully that's something that can be remedied with a firmware update. I'm gonna release some more videos in regards to the VMate as they release more firmware. Uh, I'm not gonna do it as they release one firmware, but when they release three or four, hopefully, or maybe one major one that seems to fix it, uh, I'll post another one just to show you guys how that's coming along. Right now, I don't know if I can recommend the VMate because of the fact that that angle is an issue. Uh, a lot of the software features, when you go to click on them, basically say they're in development, so they're not even ready yet. Focusing still has a bit of an issue. Like I said, the SD card is a huge issue. Uh, audio, eh, right now. The Bluetooth microphone that's supposedly coming is coming, but it's not there, so that's, that's an issue because we can't use it. Focus, straightening. Yeah, and I guess, I guess that's it. I guess that's it. I'm going to leave you guys there. Hopefully we see some more updates come from them soon so that we can get this thing thing running properly. Because I think you think the hardware is good. I still don't know why they didn't release it with any kind of tripod adapter on it so that you can mount a tripod. There's just nothing. There's nothing on it that you can stick a tripod to. Like this, That just seems so ridiculous to release a camera with no tripod mount. Like what is, what is that? A GoPro mount, something. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to leave you guys there. Uh, I will put a link to where you can buy it if it is something that you are interested. Uh, I'll put one to Snopa's website as well as I think there's an Amazon link that I found. Put you one there as well. Uh, and that's it. Like, comment, share, and subscribe, my friends. Play safe. You know, do your social distancing. And do whatever you can to keep yourself nice and healthy. And we will see you hopefully tomorrow in a new video. All right, my friends. Later. What you got there? What you got? <laughs> that's like, a, that's all the rolls we got right there. It says 12 double rolls. I'm like, double what? What? This is tiny. It and costs like, like $900. Bougie bamboo from Whole Foods because that's the only place that still has <laughs> toilet paper. Yeah. You only got one roll? One? package yes we don't need more than that okay i don't know we're not insane i guess <clears throat>